Hello people, in this video let us look at the textbooks available for studying pathology for MBBS students. So the textbook which um, people use is actually this one Harsh Mohan. Okay, so this comes as a book, a really big book like this. Okay, and it also comes with a small pocket kind of a review book which people seem to revise. Okay. So, but there is only one big book that you have to read, Hashmohan Pathology. But this seems to have few mistakes, which, um, okay. Then, uh, coming to this one, Robbins and Cotran, Robbins Pathology. Basically, this is a very good book, but it doesn't go as per your um, syllabus. If you want the point-wise bullet points, such things are not there. But this is a reliable book, okay, Roberts and Cotran, many students use this. This comes in two uh, separate books. So if you want, you can prefer this or if you want a single book, you can go for a single book like Hash Mohan. Now coming to this one, many students uh, read this one also. This is Ramdas Nayak. It doesn't say it's a textbook. It's more like a question answer, question answer, question answer, chapter wise kind of a thing. This looks a little colorful actually, this book inside kind of looks interesting also. So look at this book um, and you will be able to decide which one you want to buy. Then coming to practical pathology, it is good if you can buy this um, practical pathology book by Hash Mohan again. So this book actually I have and um, it kind of helps you know to review the gross and review the histology specimens. It's really useful. Also spotters, instruments, Right, all pathology instruments, all of them are there. Lumbar puncture needle, all with images they have explained about these um, instruments. So this book is kind of useful. Okay, so this is about uh, the textbooks for pathology, the realistic books that actually students read. Right. Now let us look at what the university recommends. You may want to revisit your university website to get the recommended books. So some of the recommended books are here, Robbins, Harshmohan, etc. Next level, if you want, you can go for reference books. Level 1 reference books are available. All these are le level 1 only. Okay. Then level 2, look at level 2. Level 2 recommendation. And then here you have the level 3 recommend, uh, reference books. Okay. So you have to buy textbooks mainly. So you have to better flip through the pages of these books. And then you can decide what to buy, okay? And if you are doing combined study and all of you want to uh, keep the same book, then definitely you people should discuss with each other before buying, okay? So that's all for now, guys. Hope you have understood uh, the options available for the textbooks of pathology. Bye-bye. Guys, just one more thing. Along with your textbooks, you should buy question banks, okay? Question banks will give you idea of how the questions would be given to you, okay? and the priority questions so you will be able to know what to focus on more right if you want to pass right these are the high priority questions you will know that if you want to study everything that is good but if you want to know what is important also then you should buy a question bank okay